All right. I think we're good. Do I see me moving around? Okay, I'll know in a minute as I pull this up. We've got some issues to fix. Number one, my field type of snow is messed up. It's not taking it, so chances are the fill type gets registered under a different name. It takes it in the tipper though. I just don't know what it's adding into the files. But we have it set up as SNOW. So we're going to crack open the seasons mod here and see how it's registered. It was just a Twitch stream. We're, I, my game was finding, f going fine. Uh, the stream I didn't realize was a little bit behind. All right. So I'm going to have to grab the seasons mod here. Anybody know what's what it's a called? Uh, if it's actually spelled, I just got to make sure snow is spelled correctly. RM seasons. Let's copy that. Put it in here. Extract files. See if we can see how it registers. Eliminate that first. Da, 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 da. Let's see if we got anything in the mod description. Nothing there. Uh, we've got XML files, resources, environment. There's our snow material. Source files. We've got a SS main Lua. Let's check our Lua files out. I think it was just called... Yeah, I want to see what it's registered as a fill type. How is it registering the fill type? Because... It is not picking up. My triggers aren't picking it up. Not in the main Lua. Loader. Placeables. Let's see. Load all scripts. Da -da -da -do. I'm looking for the loading. Uh, adding a fill plane. Fill type of snow. I think I actually included snow in my map. Didn't I add it in originally? I can't remember. Uh, log file might show it. But I thought it was just snow. Um, it might need to be added in, but let me go into my mod description file. Did we add snow? No, so it adds it in. It might throw up an 
error that it's already registered. I'm just trying to find out what it fires off. Uh, log text. Let's see if we can see it in here. We register our additional map types. Sorghum. Oh, that's perfect. I got an idea. Um, it should be in our save game file. Save game two. Uh, career save game. Fill type, it's just snow, S-N-O-W, all lowercase. I don't know why my triggers aren't picking it up. So, hmm. Let's see what we got. We've got the trigger. Snow is the fill type, all lowercase. On that trigger. It's a liquid trigger. Maybe we need to switch the trigger to a tip trigger instead of a liquid trigger for snow. We will try that out. Oh, there it is right there. Liquid trigger has a fill type of water. That would make a difference. For that one. So I'm not worried about the name as much as Snow Fill Trigger. So there is that. That's in the Liquid Trigger Index. But the Shovel Target. What is up with that? Probably set to cold still or something. <laughs> Who knows with me. I don't think it has settings on the shovel target. It takes it from the main group usually. And... Yeah... Might not be able to use a shovel right now. We're going to... We've got the shovel. I'm going to bring it up to the top of the fence line here just for the heck of it. There's a shovel target. Should be able to dump it right in there. But for some reason it wasn't working. Uh, bail trigger. That has to come out. Rostov 2. So it would not allow my shovel. If I can't get it to shovel, you're going to have to load it into a tipper. Uh, I'm not going to mess with it all day. We're we're way longer than I wanted to, but at least we know if the tipper works, I'll be happy for now. We'll come back to it at some other place. I don't think a lot of people are going to use the shovel anyway. Well, they might if we get a fix, but let's get that down here out of the way. Let's try it with the tipper. See if anything happened with that before we go too crazy with our stuff. It shouldn't now it, uh, fill types should be added. It was just a matter it's in there. Snow is in there. It's registered. 
it's in the bulk category because it could go in tippers. It's just, uh, I'm pretty sure the water fill trigger is the whole issue. It might not take snow because it's a water fill trigger. We may have to get a regular tip trigger, but we're going to try it with the snow setting correctly now. And as far as the shovel trigger, you got me. We still got to get uh, another one of these put in. The ground labels. Oh, coal pile. We got to figure out what the heck happened with my coal setup. So wait till it's done saving. Then we can jump back in and work on the coal. See if we can figure that mess out. It's floating way too high. And that... shouldn't be too hard to fix here. But it will be. So it started off just fine. And then, no, it jumped right up. And it's usually because the whole tip trigger, it's probably based off the tip trigger group setting. But let's find out what we can do here. We had it minus 2.198 on the Y, and it was still shooting up way too high. And minus point. 036 I'm not sure let me see how high my this is going to require math let's see what the tip trigger itself group is set at that probably should be at zero and then the piece is moving to place So a little repositioning. I noticed the other one was in a group. This one is not. If we put this at zero, and then bring up our objects. Thank you, Sagarith, for the five bits. Bring our objects back up. We'll probably get the correct ones. We'll know shortly. Um, our tip trigger has a move min max Y on it. Our tip trigger group. That is why it, the heap didn't have it on it. Our tip trigger group has a... Did you guys catch that? Uh, I just did. So our tip trigger group actually has the settings. And not the heap. Which is weird. Because the tip trigger itself would then be going up and down. Unless it just detects the heap settings from that. Well, we're going to set it up that way. We have a move min max so let's bring that back up to where we want it to be which is right there and we will start the move min y at 0 0.94 cuz that's where it is, or wait, no, we're going to probably have to do the heap here. It has a move back trigger too. 
let me go down here and put the, these values into where this is. Yeah, the heap values. We'll give it another try. I hate tip triggers. They all work different depending on how they're set up in different mods. But this is on the group. So we're going to delete the values and see what happens. Off of the heap itself, move them up. Delete that. Minus 2.198 and 0 .03, minus 0 0.036. Come on, hamsters. Minus 2.198 to minus 0 0.36. All right. Trigger index 2. Trigger width. All right. Moving index is 3. So 0. One, two, three. So that's the moving index. It's giving it an index number. We should be good. Let's keep our fingers crossed and see what happens. And Salus, thank you for the bits. I'm going to just keep going. I keep getting bits every hour. Although, we'd like to get a map today, wouldn't we? If I can get everything except for the shovel trigger to work, I'll be happy. Shovel trigger, we'll see if we can get it to work at some other time. But as long as you can get snow in with the tipper, you can drive around, load up, bring your snow over. I'll be good with that. And it melts it. Oh, well, we got to come back in and... We probably should have messed with the numbers. Well, let me, yeah, I hate this. I hit the save button. Now we got to do our numbers for our inputs and outputs. So we'll save it again. Let's get those back to close to where we want them. Once we're done here with this save... So we're going to do, we'll do that. We'll do two snow equals one water and like 0 0.1 coal or something like that. We don't want you having to run coal over. Water is going to transfer pretty quickly. So we'll input two snow. Uh, output one water and point one on the coal for our values. We hold two million. Um, we don't have a value set up on the, these uh da, da 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 what was it called anybody remember um let's go up to one that i remember has it 
the ore smelter, did that have a value on them? Let me check. I gotta remember what it's called. I think it was... I can't remember, my brain is fried. It's time to uh, eat dinner. <laughs> factor, F-A-C-T-O-R of two. So we're gonna put a factor field on these down here. Uh, get the right mod. All lowercase factor. And we're going to set it. And it's a float or an integer. We'll use the float. Float always works. Yeah, it's got to be a float if we're going to use decimals. Anyway. All right. So... We need to set a field called factor F A C T O R as a float. Snow is going to be a factor of two. And then we'll Big Daddy with rest in peace cheer. Oh man, I'm dying. No. Oh, this one already has it cold, but we're going to knock it way back on this one to just point 0.1 for coal factor. And we'll just check our product one output and make sure it's at one. If it doesn't have a factor, it's going to be one. Do you guys actually get to choose what cheers you're given? Water, leader, uh, let's bump it up. We want to have a lot of water in. We only, we need another zero. Two million works. Wolfie with a hundred rest in peace cheers. I guess that answers my question. Or at least it looks like, what is that cheer? Yeah, rest in peace. That's a little different, probably because of the amount. All right, factors are set. Jump in. Maybe our snow will still be on the ground. If not, we'll do SS snow and make it SS snow. You guys are a bit crazy. Yeah, you're a bit crazy today. <laughs> one down, one to go. Another town and one more show. I've been staring at this water pit for way too long today. But hey, how many maps have the snow melting? You want to do a snow cone factory? Go for it. Sail is for five more bits. You guys are incredible. I can't even tell you how much bits that is. Uh, but it, it makes a huge difference. Since the last time when I told you guys what it was, it's up about another 16 bucks. So thanks so much for that. 
that's going to help pay the bills. I think I could keep my sister. Let, she might keep me here another month. <laughs> that's the way to do it. She might let me stay a little longer. I might have enough money in there to give her a few bucks after Christmas. One PJ Salt, Big Daddy, and Sagareth with their back-to-back -back bit drops. All right, you guys. It should be saved pretty soon. Boy, I think the computer just needs a restart is what it is. It's usually not this slow saving either, but... All right, we're good. Let's go in and fire her up. Ooh, I got a notification. What is the notification? Oh, friend request. Sure. I like friends. <laughs> Save game two. Let's roll it. Be back in just a second here. Throat's getting dry. Need a cup refill. All right, we're still loading. I actually looked over at my phone and I got like five people texting me. I had it on the charger, which I didn't hear it buzzing from over here. We'll reply to those while we're loading up. I don't know how I did it. I haven't had a cell phone for five years and now all I get is people messaging me all the time. I did just fine without it. I got it just so I could, uh, yeah, work and stuff. <laughs> it's kind of handy when people need your number when you're applying for jobs, you know, and that you actually have one. Loading, loading. Man. We should be almost there. Did we check the error log since I made all these additions? I don't think so. 
I just uh, loaded up the log and that's why the big stall here just before it's done I don't think we have any but I'll check we didn't do too much you never know with me you know vehicles economica da 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 Fabric script, snow melt with nothing after it. So no errors. That's a plus. Uh, control 8, jump us over to... Oh, that's not 8. I can't reach. We've got snow. in our tipper and I don't think we're getting a trigger so it must be the trip trigger type uh, I just realized there's no back on that thing do you guys see that the pile is good but there's no back on that box you can see right through it. We're going to have to raise up that edge. Let me see if uh, the snow will dump in like so. Maybe we got to back right up. Move it out. Nope. No snow trigger. And my snow is melting. Urgh. I think we got to take off the liquid trigger and put in a tip trigger, which the only other thing I could think of. I'm expecting that the uh, loader isn't going to work either, but we'll test it out real quick. I never mess with snow, but it's for you guys. Um, come on, let's pick up some snow. See why I mean you can't get it off the road? You can uh, get it off of out here. We still got to do the snow mask. Oh, my goodness. Get a little bit of snow. So you can plow out your lot, but you can't plow the road. And thus, the snow mask is in place. Yeah, just not taking it snow into either of those places. So, back to see if we can at least get the tip trigger to work. It must be adding it as a. Hopefully, I don't. I can't think of anything else to do, or we're going to be popping this snow thing out and filling our hole in. other than replacing our liquid trigger and that is easier said than done with the tip trigger from down here because all the other pieces have to go in there so I'm gonna copy this right in and see if we can have both of them in there edit copy of course renaming our fill type and anything that needs it we can drop the min max y off the tip trigger and leave it on the liquid trigger and hopefully get it to work 
edit paste that I want to try to keep some of the elements from the other one we'll see what we can how we can reconfigure this All right. So the tip trigger triggers.